hello guys so welcome to this new video where i will show you how to secure your aws account so in previous video we created a, a brand new aws account in freetire and if you did not watch uh, go into uh, my channel and you can watch that uh, now we need to secure this account so no one can uh, misuse this uh, our aws account so uh, what we will do uh, we will uh, will enable the mfa in our root user account in our general account so which is additional layer of security so first so first question is right right like a what is a mfa so mfa is a multi-factor authentic authentication which add the one layer to your uh, in your aws account and uh, next one is a uh, question right like why we need this mfa so take an example we are logging into a aws account using a password and uh, username and password and if these are leaked so uh, anyone can log into your account and do anything so therefore we need one layer of security in our aws account therefore we need to enable the mfa in a, in our aws account so mfa can be activate using a physical mfa device or we can use a virtual mfa device so for physical uh, we need to uh, order from aws or any else we can order the, the that device or for fee virtual mfa device uh, we can download any authentic authentication app from google or pla store and we can scan the code and we can generate the code also so next step is like a setup mfa in aws account so like when we set up the mfa mfa in our aws account we will scan the qr code in our device using a any authentication app uh, which already i explain you and this app will generate one pin code so that pin code you need to enter in our account one thing i need to add this like uh, when every time you need to log in into your account one uh, uh, the code uh, the new code will be generated and for uh, like uh, if and we can't use this uh, one code in for different accounts so so if you have a two user in your account if you have a two aws account then you will have to set up the two mfa once you uh, uh, set up the MFA, then next time when you log in, you need to enter uh, your username, password, and then you need to enter your MFA code. And this MFA will change every 30 seconds. So this means if anyone got your old MFA code, then AWS will deny the access to log in your account. And every time we need a new MFA code to log in into your our uh, so in log into in our uh, AWS account okay so we understand some basic of mfa now let's go to aws console where we enable the virtual mfa in our root account user and we will also see how to enable the uh, mfa in uh, our im users also so let's go in uh, our console now we are in aws console and where i can show you like uh, if you go to im user and uh, and you can see that uh, one warning like red alert is showing so add mfa for root user so aws also suggested or recommended that we need to enable the mfa for uh, adding a one layer of security so this is our brand new account which we created in previous video for create, uh, set up the mfa we need to click on this user account and click on security credentials and you can see that second option multi-factor authentication and click on activate activate mfa and uh, we have three options like uh, virtual mfa security key other hardware mfas other tools are uh, hardware devices where we need to set up which we need to order from aws or any else here but we are not doing uh, these two we are doing a uh, virtual mfa so we need to enter a name so i am entering not just developer and choose the virtual mfa and click on continue and we, you will get this option uh, for setup in mfa and uh, when you click on uh, when you click on the show qr code and then you can uh, scan the qr code and it will be entry in within that virtual mfa application 
so we will uh, have mfa code in for each account so i downloaded the some uh, authentication apps like google or uh, microsoft you can download any of our app so i downloaded the uh, google authentication app you can also download and uh, now i'm hiding this qr code for security reason and just click on show qr code and this qr code will uh, show and you need to scan this qr code you will get the pin and we need to enter the pins so i'm entering we need to enter two mfa codes so let wait for second one after generating so uh, after entering this code we need to assign the mfa so just click on F, uh, sign mfa and you can see this one this virtual mesh uh, this virtual mfa will require during sign up so after uh, like uh, when we uh, sign it from this aws account next time we try to log in we need to enter that uh, uh, virtual MF, mfa code so just close this one now i need to show you in i am user how we can set up the uh, mfa in i am user just go here and search i am and click on this one service and click on user you can see i created one user so click on this one user and just click on security credentials and you can see here one option assign mfa device so you can click and and do the same step which i showed in your show you in this video so i'm not doing this one uh, you can do that now we need to log out sign out here and just log in again in our account so login it back i'm entering my email address password now now this will ask mfa code so new you need to enter that mfa code which you scanned so i'm entering that mfa code now you can see we log in into our in our aws account so you can see that we added one more layer of security in our aws account so in next video we will see how we can set up the budget in aws account for that we need to subscribe our channel and thanks for watching this video thank you so much